I'm gonna run on the treadmill for one hour. That's 60 minutes. I don't even know how I'm gonna do it because I can't even run for five minutes without fighting for my dear life. But you already know I love challenges. I love challenging myself. And if you want to know how running on the treadmill for one hour for seven days went, keep watching. I hate cardio, but the treadmill is the best form of cardio. Now running has its own benefits, which I want, I need. Like it helps build strong bones and muscles. It strengthens the muscles, improves your cardiovascular tissues. And the best part is it burns a lot of calories. It burns a lot of fat. And that is exactly what I want. I have been trying to avoid cardio for the past month, ever since I started my fitness journey. But I feel like cardio is really important to burn fat. Avoiding cardio only because I don't like it was basically me lying to myself because I harmed no one other than myself by doing that. Now, I want to challenge myself to work on the treadmill for one hour straight because I know with all my heart, with all my heart, I hate the treadmill. I hate cardio. I can't even be on the treadmill for more than 15 minutes. Okay, positive affirmations. I love the treadmill. I work amazing on the treadmill. The treadmill is my favorite form of exercise. Sometimes you gotta fight yourself to be better. Quotes by Nimesha. Let's go check my weight and let's look at my body before. Okay, so here's how I look before. So as you can see, my weight is right now at 51.8. Okay, so it is day one. I'm pretty excited. I have no idea how it's gonna go. If by any chance y'all don't see this video, it's probably because I gave up. Hold on, Nimesha never gives up. It's not in my blood to lose or to give up. I am gonna try my best to keep going after the first two minutes. Okay, so basically what I'm going to be doing for day one is I am going to walk for three minutes and I'm going to run for two minutes. And then I'm gonna just keep repeating that until I complete the 60 minutes. Now I'm doing that only because I'm just starting off. I'm not a runner, I hate running and I hate the treadmill. Stop being so negative. And I personally don't think I have the stamina to actually run for an entire hour, but I'm pretty sure by the end of this challenge, my stamina will probably improve I will feel much better and I'll probably have the strength to at least run for 20 minutes straight. I'm going to keep trying. I'm going to do my best. By the end of this seven day challenge on the treadmill, I want to be able to run for 15 minutes to 20 minutes straight non-stop. That's my goal. Anyways, let's see how my body improves in seven days, if it does. So keep watching. I love wearing black to the gym. It makes me feel extremely powerful for some odd reason. But anyways, here's me running on the first day, having doubts about this challenge, to be honest. It was difficult, but anyways, look at that ass. Okay guys, so I'm back home. Mission accomplished. Well, I did walk more than run. The plan was to run for two minutes and walk for three minutes. That's four, okay. But I was not able to do it. So I walked more than I ran. But you know what? It's all about improving. Uh, hopefully I'll improve tomorrow. Hopefully I will be able to stick to the plan tomorrow because I don't know, I was just really exhausted. My stamina was like, and I couldn't run. After like the fourth set, I couldn't run. I was like, okay, now mind. If this is how far my body can go, I respect it. You gotta respect your body. So yeah, but damn, I was sweating. And I don't usually sweat and I hate sweating because I'm not used to sweating. But when I was running, I was sweating. Which makes me feel like I accomplished something because I never really sweat. Before getting further into this video, I want to show you guys a product that made my life so much more easier, which is this Lamiku wallet case. Basically, it's a phone cover with a wallet attached to it, which can hold my card, cash, or ID wherever I go. Moreover, it also protects my phone. It also comes with a strong strap that holds my phone, which means even if I drop the phone, it won't fall out. Or you could also use this shoulder strap, which makes protecting your phone even better. If you're interested in this product, I will link it below, and you could also use this discount code. For a person like me who's always busy running errands and loves to travel light, this is the perfect product for me. Okay, you guys, so it is day two. So if you're wondering if I'm sore, yes, I am sore. I mean, because I started running on the treadmill for an hour out of nowhere, and my body's probably wondering, what is wrong with this girl? But I feel like the warm up and cooling down actually saved my life because I expected to be more sore, and I know that if I didn't stretch or cool down, I would be more sore today, but I'm not, thanks to stretching and cooling down. Anyways, today's day two. 
let's go hopefully today i'll actually do two minutes of running and three minutes of walking so i am back home day two was much easier for some reason i didn't eat a lot today and i was about to faint on the treadmill so i didn't do the last 10 minutes i feel fit i was sweating so much because i actually stuck to the plan i did two minutes of running and three minutes of walking and i feel so happy i feel so productive because i actually did it but if i didn't feel like fainting i would have completed the r but i didn't because i didn't want to jeopardize my health even when i wanted to faint i was like okay i kept going i kept going and then i only gave up when i had no other choice but to give up so i don't think it's called giving up it's called taking healthy precautions okay you guys so it is day three i'm super excited i have the energy to complete the art today because y'all know what happened yesterday anyways let's go i'm ready for day three although i'm a little exhausted right now but let's go i'm walking home Okay, you guys, so I completed day three and I successfully got the job done today. I ran for one hour and I'm so proud of myself. However, my ankles hurt and I feel like I'm going to be sore tomorrow for some reason. Like my ankle is in so much pain right now. But you know what? Do it for the gram. Do it for the gram. Okay, you guys, so it is the final day. You know what that means. Time to check the results. So this is my weight before. And this is my weight now. And this is how I look before. And this is how I look now. Okay, so as you guys saw, there is a difference in my weight which is amazing for one week and there's also a difference in my appearance a tiny difference but it means a lot because I've only been doing this for seven days imagine if I did this for 30 days I cannot imagine the results because I would be the next Kendall Jenner from Walmart but on a serious note I'm extremely happy with the results that I achieved from this challenge for one week I think it's pretty good I mean I sort of did expect the results because one hour on the treadmill for seven days straight without any breaks yeah that will definitely have a big impact on your body for sure like i knew i would see a difference and this was exactly what i expected not too much not too less so if i do this for four weeks straight i will lose four kg which is awesome but the thing is i'm not actually looking forward to losing weight because i'm extremely happy with my weight but i'm definitely happy with the fat that i lost as you saw in the picture there is definitely a difference i could see it it's a small difference but it's still different something is better than nothing and honestly it's not just the weight loss difference or the you know the appearance difference i honestly feel much stronger i have no idea why i feel that way but i definitely feel much stronger the outcome of this challenge is actually great because i saw a difference and it also made me feel different about actually running on the treadmill before i hated running even 10 minutes on the treadmill but now i feel like i'm definitely going to add this into my workout routine i'm going to walk for about 20 to 40 minutes some days and i'm going to promise myself not to avoid cardio or hit and i feel like i could challenge myself more like you know increasing the incline and stuff like that or maybe running for four minutes straight and walking for four minutes straight i could get creative with the treadmill if I also feel so lightweight because after my workouts after running on the treadmill I sweat so much and I feel like my skin glows after that for some reason and I feel so lightweight and it honestly made me feel so much better and I would definitely recommend running on the treadmill and I honestly feel so proud of myself because I honestly thought in the beginning of this challenge I wouldn't be able to do it but the thing is mind over matter I programmed my mind to actually like running anyways that's about it for this video if you enjoyed this video make sure you give this video a thumbs up 
and let me know in the comment section below any other video ideas or workout challenges you guys would love for me to do and do not forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and hit the bell button to get notified whenever i post and yeah that's it for this video and i will see you guys in my next video Bye bye